Hi guys, uh, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create uh, a tire which is pretty simple and it is used by modeling something that is not uh, that not needs uh, tires that are fully realistic just uh, a tire with some detail on it uh, so this is going to be it. I'm going to hide this one. I made this frame previously, and you can uh, watch how you can create such rims in my tutorials for rims. So let's get to creating tires. We go to standard primitives and select cylinder. We create shape uh, with eight height segments, two cap segments, and 60 sides. We convert it to editable poly. Then we select the center polygons on both sides. So you have to be sure you don't have ignore back facing uh, selected then we will bridge these polys and we will scale them scale 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 them out outwards so before we do that, we will center the center tire to the rim. Now we have these uh, polys pushed to the sides, and we are going to scale them outwards a little bit, so we get this tension outwards. Then we will select. polygons on each side holding shift and clicking will select the whole uh, side then control, holding control and holding shift will select the other side too then we will inset holding shift and clicking on it and we will um, by Paul by group and we will scale these polygons to the inner side a little bit so we get a little bit of tension again see here okay now we're going to chamfer the edges of the tire so we're going to select one and on the other side then loop and holding shift and pressing chamfer selecting two segments and clicking OK now we're going to uh, Select select these polygons for the center I'm getting selections that I don't want basically so you have to be careful here not to select uh, the inner sides of the tire not really that uh, important but it sure helps to keep it clean so I'm going to try to select these ones and then deselect the center part 
holding alt on the keyboard and here we go so now we have to inset selected uh, polys and we are going to uh, insert them down by polygon and just a little bit so we get these dimensions then we will bevel them shift bevel uh, again just touch so we get this kind of uh, creation then we will select sent ones inset them by group we do the same on the other side and we will select both of them and extrude them by local normal and here we have a simple tire now we can modify it a little bit more if we want we select vertices and then we select only the center part select only the center part and with the help of soft selection we select uh, only the parts that are going to be twisted a little bit so we uh, select and rotate and we rotate these vertices downwards a little bit now we can go back to soft selection and increase the selection and we select an uniform scale tool and we scale it out a little bit just to get this uh, round feeling of the tire now we can select edges on this side This side on and on the other side as well, and we select ring and connect it once. Control vertex and with select a uniform, push it outwards a little bit, just to get that feel of our inflated tire. So now we select the whole tire and we just scale it down so it fits the selected rim. So here it is. It's basically not really, really great, but you get the point of how to create such tires. I hope you enjoyed it and see you till next time. Bye.